Love is a strange thing. They usually say it's the best thing in the world, when it works out. Usually it just makes people do and think crazy things. For Lewis Johnson, this is almost always the case. This was an emotion that he couldn't comprehend. Every time a love song played, he would always think, why not me? Time and time again he tried, but success always seemed to slip from his fingers. You're a really nice guy and all, but I don't really see you like that. I wouldn't want to make things weird between us. I like how things are now. Sorry, sweetie, I already have a man. <laughs> uh, no. Nothing was worse than when he found himself catching feelings. But then, love would take over everything. This naturally led to academic Damn. issues. Damn. Every time he fell head over heels, it was trouble. Cause once he started tripping, he pulled everyone down with him. Every time, man, you get hung up on this. You take it way too hard. You can miss a ball here today. Remember what he said, stroke it gently. Don't mess. Game. All right, can we get some real balls, some 808 and heartbreaks here? So, who's the Helen of Troy in this story? Listen, I think you got the wrong idea. I like you, but like a friend and only as a friend. I don't think anything can happen between us. Oh. Miss Liliana Lamouk. How fitting her last name meant matched in Tagalog for she had mashed his heart into a thousand pieces. After all the signs in the past heartbreak, Lewis wondered, when was it going to be his time? When would he succeed? Yo, hey, Lewis, won't you shut the hell up? Wait, what? Oh, no. Thinking out loud again. Every time that you catch the slightest of feelings, this happens. Just because she says hi doesn't mean that she's the one. You turn this thing into the 40-year-old virgin, putting the punani on the pedestal. You're like thinking, oh, Oh snap, she smiled at me, maybe she likes me. No, maybe she was just, you know, being polite, returning the favor, all of that stuff. You're just turning something small into something even bigger. How have you hurt yourself in the past few minutes? You've been babbling on and on, out loud, talking about yourself in the third person. What is that? Man, you got some selective ass memory. Damn. Damn. Sucks for you. I know, right? gotta do is just, you know, talk to a girl and like, let her know how you feel and whatnot, instead of like assuming that, oh, since she said, oh, bless you once you sneeze, like, it means something, you know? It's, it's simple. Yeah, you're probably right. You gonna be alright? Uh, I hope so. It's okay, babe. Hey, Louis. Are you Yeah. Yeah, you should be alright. Yo, we're about to go to Wackadoo's and get some of the grub on. You wanna come? No, I'm good, man. I'm not that hungry. Hey, just come out with us, man. We're about to get some fat ass beers. Come on. Man. No, I'm good. For real? Yeah. Alright, man. We're about to head out. You ready to go? Yeah. Alright, yo. I'll see you around. Good luck again. Don't let that stuff face me, man.
Sorry. Sorry. Sorry about that. No, it's okay. Nice hair. Thanks. Oh no. This is bad.